To be successful in an increasingly challenging operating environment, airlines need to maximise profit margins and protect their bottom line. A significant area in which they can achieve this is aircraft performance. So Captain Ben, the last time I saw you was in Paris. You must have clocked up quite a few hours on the aircraft now. Yes, Arthur, it's nice to see you again. We have been flying the two around the world in demo flights, so I'm happy to, to, to be here again. Now, transitioning from the first generation of E-Jets, the E-1, into the E-2, it's quite a straightforward process, isn't it? From pilot point of view, it's almost the same airplane. Only two days and a half of ground training. No simulator is needed. Of course, the fly-by-wire system helps protect the airplane envelope and also keep the same handling qualities for the pilot. And what differences do you know in terms of performance? The fuel savings. We used to fly with a lot of E-1 pilots and they used to say, the fuel that I should arrive after my flight, but I'm beginning the flight with this fuel uh, quantity, so it's unbelievable. What are the impressions that you're receiving from some of the passengers? This fly-by-wire helps to maintain a smoother flight. We have this turbulence avoidance system, so it's very comfortable and the passengers are very happy to fly the E2. I like this plane very much, as I have experience in airlines I can feel the difference. This airplane is very quiet. We have a lot of space. For the flight attendants, we'll feel safe and comfortable when the passengers are comfortable. For us, it's very important because it makes our job very easy. 